verse 24, Revelation 2, 24. Jesus goes on to say in this letter, But I say to you, the rest who are in Thyatira, who do not hold this teaching, who have not known the deep things of Satan, as they call them, I place no other burden on you. So here he says, now remember, this is talking about, we're in this whole section here to the church of Thyatira, about them tolerating the woman Jezebel, who calls herself a prophetess, and is teaching this filth to the church. Yes. But they, oh, how, like God said, oh, how my people love it so. Right. Because it's justifying the things that they want to do in the flesh, right? Their desires. But the rest are those here, the rest who are in Thyatira, are those, he says, who do not hold to the false teaching. Mm -hmm. They are the remnant. Yes. The Lord... Not his, not, not his brothers, not Joseph's brothers, sent Joseph into Egypt. That's right. Okay? Through the well, through the prison. The slavery, yeah. That was God. That's what, you know, when, when he's finally confronted by his brothers, he says, you meant this for evil, but God meant it for good, right? But it also says that God sent Joseph into Egypt to preserve a remnant by a great deliverance. It's in, in Genesis 45. Go check it out. To preserve a remnant. Now, a remnant... Is what's left. I'm sure, you know, you probably have a good idea of what a remnant is. I mean, I actually did consulting work in the New York Garment District, District mm -hmm. many years ago. I was a, a business consultant in New York. And in the Garment Center, the, the better the clothing is, uh, patterns match. They they yeah. cu they cut yeah. to make sure that all the patterns in a piece of cloth mm -hmm. in a garment match, which means that there's typically a little more waste. Right. Well, those wastes that is remnants. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So a remnant, and I'm just going to read you from the dictionary. This is from uh, Random House Dictionary. A remnant is a remaining, usually small part, quantity, number, or the like, a, f a fragment or a scrap. A small, unsold, or unused piece of cloth, lace, etc. at the end of a bolt. A trace, a vestige. Get the idea? Mm -hmm. It's a small part of, of the great big that's left. Okay. The word remnant comes from the old French word remenoir. Oh, is that? The, did I sound like Clouseau? Clouseau. Yeah. Remenoir. Mm -hmm. Meaning to remain. To, to remain what? I believe that Jesus answered that question a long, long time ago. In the Gospel of Matthew, Jesus said, You will be hated by all because of my name, but it is the one who has endured to the end who will be saved, the one who remains. Right? Mm, the remnant. Now, in these seven letters to the seven churches, mm -hmm. think about this, right? It says that to, me. Hmm. to the church at Ephesus, he said, you have perseverance and have endured for my name's sake and have not grown weary. They remain. Mm. To the church in Smyrna, he said, you will have tribulation. Be faithful unto death. Remain. To the church at Pergamum, just before Thyatira, he said, you hold fast my name and did not deny my faith. They remain. And here, to the church under consideration, Thyatira, he says, what you have Hold fast until I come. Mm. That's in a couple of verses or next verse up. Remain. It's about remaining. Remaining what? Remaining faithful. Remaining steadfast. Right. Enduring till the end. end. Persevering. That's his remnant. That's the remnant. Now, and, and I've said this before, when you talk about persevering, you talk about endurance. You don't mm -hmm. have to endure things that you enjoy. Mm -mm. Okay. You endure things that you are hard. Yeah, things you don't like. Things you don't like. <clears throat> but you see, this, <clears throat> this is always, from the beginning, been about a remnant. Yes. Okay? Yes. It's always been about a remnant. Just listen to these verses. I'll give you a couple of examples. Yes. Isaiah chapter 10. I'm going to read verses 21 and 22. A remnant will return, the remnant of Jacob to the mighty God. For though your people, O Israel, may be like the sand of the sea, only a remnant within them will return. <laughs> Through the prophet Zephaniah, God said, But I will leave among you a humble and lowly people, and they will take refuge in the name of the Lord. The remnant of Israel will do no wrong and tell no lies. Hallelujah. 
Paul in the New Testament in Romans chapter 11 says, in the same way then, there has also come to be at the present time a remnant according to God's gracious choice. Who? A whole, a humble and lowly people. Oh.